What's up guys, it's your boy Cliff Camaro. We're back with another video. And in today's video, we're gonna be playing Pokemon Sword and Shield, the first part of it. And in Pokemon Sword and Shield, I already passed everything. I've passed the Isle of Armor, Crown and Tundra, and the normal Galar region. Um, the only thing that we're gonna be doing here is like evolving Pokemon or seeing new stuff or getting new legendaries. And there's only one catch to this. I can only get Pokemon that can evolve into other Pokemon. Like, let's say I get a Garchomp. Like, I find a random Garchomp. I'm not going to actually get him, though. If I find that random Garchomp, I can't catch him. I can only defeat him. But let's say I get a Gibble or the Evolution or a Gabite. I'm going to be able to um, evolve Gibble to Gabite. Or I can get the Gabite to evolve into a Garchomp. But I'm not going to be able to get a free Garchomp. Same for... Um, like a Lucario. I can only get a Lucario if I do a Riolu. But there's only but there's only one thing that I can do with them. I can what I can do is I can get legendaries and I can get Pokemon that don't evolve and they don't have evolutions. So I'm gonna be able to do most of the stuff, but it's gonna be hard for me to evolve. So I'm usually not going to get that many Pokemon, but I'm going to try my best to evolve. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Subscribe and like if you want to see more parts to this. And I'm showing you it in three, two, one. Oh. I'm sorry if it's not like full screen mode in for this stuff. It's just because like, I am not um, on computer for this, but I am going to be able to do stuff. Like this Metagross right here, I'm not going to be able to catch him and all, but I'm going to be able to fight him. So I'm going to fight him and all. Um, but I'm going to try my best to get like as much Pokemon as I possibly can because I love Pokemon, as you tell from my um, profile picture. It's a Charizard because I love Charizard. Um, my uh, I have a lot of favorite Pokemon on my list. Charizard is my first. I'm not going to be able to get these Pokemon exactly because I really don't know how those things evolve. I don't even want to try to get on YouTube because I want to be good about myself. I'm 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 good without a YouTube. So let's see what this Pokemon will be, and it's going to be this. I am not going to take a fence up. Even though if this thing can evolve into a Trevenant, I don't want a Trevenant right now. A Trevenant will not be my thing for now. What will be my thing will be able to get other Pokemon. Since in this region, there's these random Pokemon in every direction that you go. And um, some things probably will be off camera that I'll do. So, probably, like, after videos, I'll still play on this. Or I'll just stop. But it's usually going to be that I'm going to play on this. Because there's nothing else to do than having fun. And fun is fun. But I got a Crobat earlier from a Golbat. Because, of course, you cannot find a Crobat in a random place. The only way that you can get a Crobat from a Golbat is if you have some fun in the camp. It has to have two hearts. It's going to be able to. I will explain it in another video. For now, no. I'm not going to make any sampleizations right now because I don't feel like it. Let's get this Beldum to evolve into what will be become a um, Metagross since I have a Metagross but it does it's not evolved and I made this rule a couple of weeks ago like two weeks ago aroundish because it's it's just fun if you evolve Pokemon instead of actually just getting the big ones like it doesn't make sense to me, I, I feel like it makes more sense if you just straight up get the Pokemon. Like, my, I have a Talon Flame that at least a couple of weeks ago, three weeks ago, I got a Talon Flame and a Crocodile. I got a Crocodile like two weeks ago. Um, it's because I evolved. I, the point of view for that is to just evolve. 
keep on evolving your Pokemon and they're going to be able to be what you want to be. You don't have to follow my rule into like just straight up um, doing the evolution thing, like the rule that I'm doing. I don't want you guys to copy me because then it will be annoying for you. You do what you want to do. Um, but I'm probably not going to be talking that much in this video. I'm going to be able to talk, just not that much, since, like, focusing, concentrating. I don't want to annoy you guys. So, I'm going to stop talking for a little bit. Oh, um, one thing, though. Beldums are really hard to catch. I It took me at least... 50 Pokeballs to get one build up. Like you see. And the only move it does know is um, Tackle, which is annoying. Okay. It's not even, it's not even rolling around. The ball is not even rolling around, but it's okay. I know one way to grind levels on this, and that way is to camp. When I'm camping, I'm gonna be able to, like, to use a feather, and it's gonna attract the Pokemon. I'm sorry if you can't see the full screen, it's just like not a lot going on right now. Okay, guys, I might have to just hit one shot on this thing. Because this thing will never do anything. He'll just stand still. He'll, he'll never move out of the ball. So I'm going to have to hit him. Oh, dang. This thing is tough. This thing won't get in my Pokemon. Last time I got a bell down, it took me about like 45 or some, to 50 Pokeballs. It was hard. Like I was, I was getting pretty mad over just one simple bell down. I don't want to get mad now because I get why a bell down wouldn't want to get my Pokeball because it's just a robot and it can't trust a random trainer. Um, earlier today, I got Zamazenta. I don't, because I didn't know how to get really Zamazenta. It's not because I'm new, it's because I lost the first time in the, um, Windon, Windon, um, tournament. So then I figured out how to get back in and all of that. So then I started getting everything done. And there, it, it just straight up got on my ball after three, three circles. Okay, this thing's kind of getting annoying. I don't like the fact how it's just not getting my Pokeball. I respect the fact of why is it so scared. The only thing that I don't respect is the fact that it keeps on using Tackle. Because when I got my Beldum, it literally only had the move Tackle. I'm like, bro, where do you only get the move Tackle from? Which was kind of funny.
which then I figured out that camping gave me levels, so I started using camping for my Golbat to evolve. I know Bottom is shy of me. He's like, no, I don't want to get in your ball. And there, we caught a Beldum. Um, That was good. I'm going to take out my Crobat for a little, no, actually my Reggie Steel for a little bit. My, don't worry, my Swamper and my, um, I'm not going back through the Swampert and stuff like that, just so you guys don't trust me like that. But like, it's true, I actually got the Crobat. Oh shoot, I just set my charger back in the box on accident. Um, I'm definitely gonna have to get my charger back. There he is. As well as my um, Beldaman for my Registeel. My Reggie Steel will go here. Also, I got all these legendaries from the Crown of Tundra. This was the, uh, I got this one from a turtle, from a small turtle I evolved it to. Because you can tell most Pokemon don't start from level 66. They're either at like 65, 62, 63, stuff like that, not 66 usually um and my metagross that's the one that i was talking about i just i want to get a metagross again it, it's just fun getting a metagross again i really don't know why but i'm building back my pokey tent that's what i call it there he is come here I think, guys, after getting two evolutions, we're going to try to defeat a legendary. Maybe. We don't know. I really, for surely don't know yet. Pretty sure after it's tired, it's gonna be able like, to level up once. But I wonder when it's gonna be tired. Oh, there you go. It's done. And, and it did not evolve. It did not level up. It didn't do anything. Which is pretty kind of disappointing, not disappointing. At the same time, both. Let's get this thing down low. Oh, that's why. That's why. That's why it didn't it didn't start doing that. I need a cook. Um 
Let's just get these random berries in. I really don't know why I just did that. Who cares? It's still um, food and he's gonna eat it. And once he finishes eating the food, um, we're gonna still use the feathers so he can evolve. Cause I really want him to become a Metagross. And I'm gonna start naming my Pokemon. I'm gonna name him Meddy. Once he's fully a Metagross. Or no, how about you guys comment in chat, what should I name him? Tell him in, sh tell me in the comments down below, what should I name my Metagross? And whichever um, name I think is best, I will pick. Or if I just don't have anybody that said a name, I'll just pick a name. It's fine, but you don't guys, guys, you don't have to say a name if you don't want to. It's only for the people that re like really want Belden to have a name. My only goal in today's video is to get a Beldum. I mean, a, a Beldum to a Metagross. I really don't know why I want that, but... At least it's good trying to. I'm gonna start making part like more parts of this every day. I'm gonna make a new video about this. Um, or maybe every day. I'm not sure. not getting a weavile i don't i don't i really don't want to get a weavile i i'm not in the mood for that stuff what i am in the mood for is to get a bell um a bell done today to metacross We have to start cooking. It seems to be that he wants some food. guys um comment down below if you want to if you want me to get a smaller pokemon inside of this in like any type of pokemon comment it down below i'll try to get them 
hopefully I'm gonna be able to get them. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to get them. Also, guys, in Sword and Shield, I'm I'm, I'm not gonna be able to. I'm not gonna make parts about some of it. Like that, I'm gonna probably make like five parts, and then all the rest is just gonna be like stuff and like Pokemon, 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 and stuff like that. Um, because I can also like I I will also do like how to get stuff in Pokemon Sword and Shield and stuff like that. Um. So for now, I'm just gonna get my bell done. Okay, Beldum leveled up. We got a meta, a meta tang right here, or matang, whatever you want to call him. I don't care. Um, there's matang. Healing confusion, metal claw. And uh, guys, I think we're gonna stop off there i know i said i'm gonna be able to get a metagross and stuff but sin um um since i showed you all the walkthrough and stuff like that uh, it's gonna be enough for today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed the banger video like and comment down below if you want to see more videos like this Hopefully you guys enjoy this enjoyed this video and see you in the next one.